It's been just few days after the Android 12 developer preview 1 is released and already there are a few working Android 12 GSI images released for all non-pixel Android devices which are trouble supported thanks to our Irfan GSI tool. Well, for your kind information, this is not a custom ROM flashing tutorial but a kind of similar one. Before starting, there are some prerequisites. You must download all these files and their links are given in the description below. A custom TWRP must be installed on your device. For this particular device which I am using is the MIA2, the link for the TWRP is given in the description. And you will find the respective TWRPs in the TWRP official site. And I am also giving the link of the official TWRP site in the description below. If you don't know how to flash a custom TWRP on your device, the video link is also given in the description, it will help you. So now let's start the process. In order for this to work, we need an Android 11 custom ROM and an Android 12 GSI image. Both the links are already given for you and you have already downloaded them. Now boot your device into TWRP recovery. After that, wipe everything in both the slots, that is Dalvik system, data, vendor, cache and internal storage for both the slots and after that format the device. After formatting, then reboot to recovery again. After rebooting to recovery, copy these two files that you have already downloaded. One is the Android 11 custom ROM, particularly for this device we are using AICP and for your device. It may vary, it may depend upon your choice. And the other file is Android 12 GSI. Copy these both files from your laptop or computer to your mobile phone. After that, first flash the Android 11 custom ROM. After the flashing gets completed, now reboot to recovery. After rebooting to recovery, now click select image file, then select the Android 12 GSI that you placed inside the phone and then click system image option and then flash it. This will take less time compared to the previous step. Now after 
flashing gets completed simply tap reboot to system that's it now just wait for the magic to happen Kaboom! Android 12 is successfully booted. I particularly can't review this right now as there are many bugs and we can't even access the device internal storage, not even from the laptop. Also. So I think that's it for this video. If there are any kind of updates about this particular GSI and bug fixes for this GSI, I'm going to make another video. So keep following me by subscribing this channel and press the bell icon to get the latest notification updates about our latest videos. So stay connected. And one more thing, don't forget to give us like. And the most important thing I forgot to mention is all the credits go to the GSI developers and custom ROM developers who worked hard here. And I'm just making the video. I had no contribution in the process of making either ROM or the GSI. I'm just an end user and I just want you to know about the process of flashing a GSI and experiencing the Android 12 before it even gets released. So that's it guys. Thank you. Bye bye.